the Me Too movement continues, a local theater school in Metro Vancouver is leading the charge to try and prevent students from becoming victims of sexual harassment in the entertainment industry. Tom Walsh has the story. Another big name in the entertainment industry is accused of sexual harassment. This time it's Canada's own Albert Schultz, director of Toronto-based Soul Pepper Theatre Company. It's the latest in a string of high-profile names in Hollywood that have been accused of sexual misconduct in the workplace. Now a theatre school in Vancouver has become the first of its kind in the country to implement policy to protect students and prepare them for the industry. Just this week we've rolled out a new policy called Not In Our Space. We're the first theatre skill school in Canada to do so. We make a speech at the beginning of every rehearsal with the director and all of the cast present, the stage management and everything, and we um, emphasize that harassment of any kind will not be tolerated in our space. Langara College's Studio 58 prepares actors over a three-year intensive course for a career in theatre. It's hoped that this new policy written by Acting Union Equity and Pact will give the actors the tools they need to protect themselves. Last year, film and TV union actor UBCP implemented their own regulations that prohibited auditions or meetings in private hotel rooms or residences where a performer is alone. It's a move aimed at setting a new precedent for those entering the industry and already in it. Our um, goal is to set up a new standard in the industry so that in 10 years we won't even really have to talk about this because everyone will understand um, respect, a respectful workplace and a workplace free of harassment of any kind. Behind me is Canada's next generation of actors. They're about to embark on one of the most competitive industries in the world. It's also coming to the limelight with the whole hashtag Me Too campaign. So, are they ready for it? In light of everything and everything that's coming out, I feel more confident going out into the industry. I feel like it's starting to become a little bit safer for me to go out there and not have to worry about um, feeling like if I do have any bad experiences that I will be shut in or won't be able to share my voice. You know, one would hope that I wouldn't have to do anything but my work. That's, that's what I, I plan to do is enter um, a safe workspace, hopefully, uh, and do my work. I just want to do my work. Yeah. And it's not just about standing up to the big names in the industry. It's also about becoming role models themselves as they go on to shape Canada's future theatre scene. A lot of these students go on to make their own work. But I'm hoping that they will have a culture of respect and anti-harassment that they will carry into the creation of their own work too. Tom Walsh, City News, Vancouver.